Tony Khan teases more AEW championships, confirms trios titles have been made, Juice Robinson signs contract extension with New Japan Pro Wrestling, Jack Evans says he got lazy outside of the ring during his time in AEW, Roman Reigns off of the WWE Hell in a Cell pay-per-view and an update on his summer schedule. Hey there everyone, I'm Denise Salcedo, you're watching the latest and let's get right into the news, kicking things off with some updates on a recent interview that Tony Khan did. Tony Khan has confirmed that AEW Trios championships have been made and also teased there could be other titles that have been as well. During an interview with TSN, the AEW president revealed that he actually had the Trios belts made a long time ago. He also noted that the purchase of Ring of Honor opens up the door to using their titles as well. Finally, Tony Khan teased other potential titles that he may be considering. Khan also spoke about booking AEW and New Japan Pro Wrestling's Forbidden Door pay-per-view with Ghetto, saying, quote, We're going to agree to a great card of matches for the two of us. I think it will be fun working with him, we're putting stuff together, and now we're kind of taking our separate ideas and separate stories and trying to find ways to make everything work with our people getting involved on each other's shows and our own respective shows and stories and staying faithful to the great things we do in AEW and the great things they do in New Japan Pro Wrestling. Jack Evans says he got lazy outside of the ring during his time in AEW. The 40-year-old's contract with the promotion was not renewed after expired at the end of April during a recent interview with Chris Van Vliet. Evans said that he feels the salary he was given by the company made him a little soft. Adding that he didn't get lazy in the ring, but he did get lazy outside of the ring. Evans also said he feels the first year in AEW went well, but he never regained his full momentum after having to miss four months at the start of the global pandemic, saying, quote, I feel like for the first year, the run actually started out good. We kind of had the place as a semi-comedic tag team. Then me and Angelico were at the Mexican border, which got closed because of COVID restrictions. We had this four-month layoff. I had this practice match when I came back and I actually got my face broken again, so there was another two-month layoff. I feel like after that, I never came back full force. I really feel like I deteriorated. During those four months, I maybe would have been used more and maybe I would have stayed on the ball more, but I didn't have that right mentality when I was on salary. I thought this would go on forever. As for what's next for Evans, he says he's currently looking for a promotion in Mexico to work for. The 33-year-old revealed the news in an interview with Sports Illustrator released on Wednesday. The only details available regarding the length of the deal is that it now runs into 2023. He said, quote, I'm keeping the details private, but I'm here when I'm supposed to be. I don't want to work somewhere else. I was about to and I was ready to, but I didn't want to. New Japan is where I belong. Also, on the latest edition of Wrestling Observer Radio, Dave Meltzer gave an update on Roman Reigns' summer schedule. Meltzer reports that Reigns is off next month's Hell in a Cell pay-per-view, but will be wrestling at other pay-per-views this summer. Reigns is still advertised for Money in the Bank, SummerSlam, and Clash of the Castle. Though Reigns has been removed from advertising for several weeks of TV this summer, Meltzer notes that Reigns will be working some of those dates. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Do not forget to give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, and we will be back with some more videos.